Hey guys, it's Freya here. So, today I'm thinking about that for I want to talking about you guys my first sketchbook. I sure about that you guys see video about this sketchbook where I just show you guys uh, what art inside in this video but I thinking about that for today I show you again the arts and I talk about it a little bit because what you need to know guys this sketchbook I started drawing I was 15 14 15 years old it's 2005 I started this and how you guys see <laughs> the clover is full with Inuyasha stickers and Inuyasha pictures so I can wait for talk about this so first of all I want to talk about why it's full with this kind weird pictures first of all yes because uh, because have this uh, lots of Inuyasha pic printed pictures and put there because I really like Inuyasha at that time, I was 15 years old, the anime was um, popular in Hungary, not that much, but in Hungary you don't really can buy anime stickers. It was a very different time, 20, I mean not 20, 2005 is a very different time. If you want to guys I can make a video where I talk about these things, but let's continue. First of all I want to talk about this art. This. I print it to you guys this is the original art this is the original art and this is I was draw um, you need to know that this I was copy so in the past I have this art much better high quality I printed a5 and I draw this around I was really really like it this picture I was a very big Digimon fan before Inuyasha and I really like this picture where uh, Taichi is touch uh, Sora face. I really like this ship too. And I was want to draw in this picture with uh, my character, I mean with Chihiro, that was her old name Chihiro and Inuyasha. I know <laughs> this art is looking very cheesy and awful but I think I was 14 so Every time I say that, somewhere need to start it the drawing. Uh, here is a first art about Chihiro. I mean, it's not Chihiro, Chiriko. Sorry, Chiriko, that was her name. She was my original Inuyasha character. i planning to redesign her. If you guys are interested in her new redesign version, just write a comment and I will make the video. So, yeah. I exactly here try to use the Inuyasha art book. In Inuyasha art book have character art from the characters and I try draw them but uh, yeah I was 15 years old so I just try to be uh, take a look how much I can drawing and these things. Here I try drawing some eyes. I never forget that for in the past I have a friend who was uh, told me for wow how good I uh, how good symmetrical a drawing eyes and yeah it's very surprised to me because I'm not sure I'm drawing that good symmetrical anymore but yeah so let's show you closer a little bit you can see because I think this eyes is pretty good and the next one too but this one is not so so yeah whatever let's continue this is again a copy art but mean that for I think it's have a picture. I I for remember good it was the Inuyasha Dojinshi was in this picture and uh, of course I again uh, draw with Inuyasha with my original character. This is a picture from the manga. I don't need to. I thought I need to. to uh, <clears throat> I don't think so. I need to too much talk about this picture because it's a very popular picture. This is. This, this is my Yu-Gi-Oh! original character. <laughs> I know it's very cheesy. Um, that time I was make uh, this sketchbook. I have a friend and she was a very big Yu-Gi-Oh! fan and uh, she asking me for oh, uh, do I have Yu-Gi-Oh! Yu original character and I just um, uh, sketched down one. It's, it's very cheesy by the way. <laughs> 
I'm not sure I'll be drawing this one, but yeah, and and it was so dumb because I don't know why I, I imagined that for oh yeah, and my Yu-Gi-Oh character have the uh, the 1,000 year old eyes. I don't know how called not eyes, uh, heart. So yeah, it's very cheesy this one. Yeah, uh, this is from a manga again. This is. Uh, one of my favorite moments from the Inuyasha manga, but sadly it's not in the anime. Uh, exactly this was original Kikyo and Inuyasha. Uh, this is, if I remember good, around the Inuyasha 52 episode uh, uh, happened this in the anime. Um, <clears throat> yeah, and before you guys asking me why have my characters wings, um, now this be a mega stupid thing. Uh, you need to know about that uh, Chirico for I don't know why but I was younger I say that for okay I make a character her name be Chirico and she'll be half angel half demon and uh, yeah I I know for in the Japanese folk tales not really have angels uh, and these things and if they have they don't have angel wings but I was a 14 15 years old kid and I don't have any idea about these things and the truth is that for that time I start watching Inuyasha I was don't know anything about the yokais and hanyos and these things so yeah this is this is what I try to draw in my own this is one of my well it's I not I don't know like I be like it this anime today but this anime name is Cyber Mario G and in the past I sure you can find YouTube if I find YouTube I put the link under the video have a music video from Hayabarashi Megumi Hayabarashi Megumi is a very popular Japanese voice actor exactly she is not just voice actor but uh, but you need to know about her, she's voice acting and singing and she do so many uh, stuff and in the 80s, 90s, um, maybe the 2000s too she was very popular in Japan, she's still popular today but in the 90s and 80s she voice acting lots of female characters and this is one of the character line from the My Cyber Manor G what she voice acting and I just uh, stop it that music video and uh, I draw in this picture. This is same from the music video. I try to uh, uh, try here a pen for the lines looking much better. And this writing, um, I use that pencil too. In this time I use more pencil. Uh, this is a Ramma half a character, it's called her Ramma. Uh, the Rama half, who know the anime that know, who don't know, it's uh, exactly it's very long story have. I don't want to now talk about the story, you look after if you're interested about it. But the main character have that uh, curse said exactly for if he, he, uh, he get the cold water, her skin, she turned to girl. And Hayabarashi Megumin was voice acting her, uh, exactly his female form. Hayabarashi Megumi was voice acting her and I draw this picture. In this picture uh, Rama uh, tastes the ice cream and that's why she makes this face. This is lime sketch again there. Here nothing. Here I was uh, try to draw in Inuyasha art. Um, I think this is from a, a pick it moment screen from the Inuyasha anime. I am not sure about it. This is my character, um, uh, Chirico's human form. Yeah, this is um, again an anime, uh, again an anime moment. Uh, I don't know which episode this, but I remember this is a Kikio character again, and exactly I driving again around Inuyasha and my old OC Chirico. This is lime, lime again, lime sketch. 
this is uh, Inuyasha picture. I don't remember this episode, which one is it, but I remember that for Ojuna I want to draw in here Inuyasha and here my OC. The Ojuna picture Kagome here, but I never finished this one. And yeah, so sometimes that's how I did arts for, I printed a picture like this. I put it here and I try to draw in here. I have lots of this in my sketchbookies just in the time lost. This one I know, if I remember good, this is from Inuyasha episode 13. Uh, it's a DVD clover. This clover happened that for Inuyasha turned first time human and Kagome uh, find out for he is a human. This was the DVD clover on it, it and it was a Kagome here original with Shippo. It's a Inuyasha in the background. I never finished this art too. This is a picture again here, I just uh, would like to draw down Chiriko's and uh, Inuyasha's daughter and son. But uh, how you see guys, I never finished this too. In the Instagram, I have a redrawing picture about this. You can find it if you want to. I redrawing that uh, different dress for Chiriko and Inuyasha. And here I try um, drawing uh, Chiriko uh, in... Inuyasha R style, but it was not really going. Inuyasha was looking pretty cool. I think I was uh, copied again. Yeah, this is from the manga again, but I never finished. And uh, I remember this one picture. Um, I never finished this one too. Short by short, I have a friend. Her name was, I think, so Tof or Tofi. And she have her Inuyasha OC and I started her OC driving down here. But in the time I was, I don't know for I was forget or I don't get picture about her character, how it looks like. And this is how I exactly um, driving in this time. Here I try to again driving more picture about my original character in Kimono, uh, human, human uh, form. So yeah, that's how exactly I was drawing. You can see how many anatomy and other problems have here. So this is my character demon form. Want to be... Yeah, here I want to draw in the other art. And yeah, I think that's, that's all. <clears throat> this sketchbook. So how you can see, guys, I know it's not a big deal, this sketchbook. I know I have lots of this... Um, this copy art but I or I printed and that's how I try to draw in the characters or I printed A4 and put under a paper and uh, drawing around but I feel that for I was 14 years old and that time I exactly <laughs> falling on the anime hall so I think it was fine if the people's doing that age these things I hope you like it this video and if you want to see more video like this leave a comment follow me subscribe everything and see you guys next time bye bye